Yo guys, it's your boy Fabian, back again with another video. And as you've seen in the title, today I'm doing something different on my channel. Obviously in the last couple of weeks, and last couple of months, there's been a lot, a lot, a lot of support from the Philippines on my channel, a lot of subscribers from the Philippines. And I thought, you know what, yeah, since I'm doing Filipino reactions quite a lot on my channel, I'm gonna start doing a lot of like Filipino content too, so not just music necessarily. So I thought, you know what, let me react to something that I saw online, but it's, kind of music related but it's not like an artist per se so um yeah as you've seen in the title it's a reaction to pinoy fan shock david foster david foster and friends live in manila 2023 and it seems as if like someone from the crowd um picked up a mic or whatever and shocked david foster who probably didn't think that individual could sing so um yeah I'm checking it out. But before we check it out, guys, make sure you subscribe down below, press the bell notification button down below so you can be the first to know when I upload. Make sure you check out all the other Filipino related content that I've put on my channel because there's quite a lot. But let's stop the talking and crack on with the video. Pinoy fan shot David Foster, David Foster and Friends live in Manila 2023. Let's go. Hi, Gwen. What's your last name? Hi, Dorado. I actually um, joined HSL Talent Season 1 if you remember. Okay, so first things first here, the camera angle, obviously this is like someone recording it from the crowd, so it's not like this is some professional recording. Second of all, this individual, I think her name was Dorada, I could be wrong, um, but yeah, she was on Asia's Got Talent, I'm pretty sure she said, so yeah, like yeah, okay, okay, like this isn't just someone random completely, but someone from the crowd, so we'll see. Yes. Well, believe me, I guess we met back then, but this is not a setup. I just picked you randomly in the audience. Uh, I don't know if you remember. <laughs> That's you and I. Yes. I do sort of remember you. Yes. I was 10 years old. You were 10? Uh, <laughs> you know what, yeah, like this kind of thing, um, Actually, let's just talk about it quickly. So, David Foster's on stage, and it seems from the sound of it, yeah, and how it looks, that he's picked someone random from the crowd um, to sing, right? And he's picked this individual. Now, this individual turns out was an Asian's Got Talent, and it was when she was 10 years old. I'm assuming they met as well, or maybe he's a judge on them, not too sure. It seems as if, like, they met before. He doesn't remember, obviously, she was 10. But yeah, like, that's a funny turn of events. He already stated as well, like, it's just a coincidence in it. Like, it's not staged. Let's see what her voice is going to be like now. How old are you now? 18. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, you had... Um, what, did you, what, what do you want to sing? Is it okay if I sing if I ain't got you? Oh. I ain't got you. Oh, I don't know that song, but, um, Bo, you know that song? Ah, this is a little bit awkward though, isn't it? Like, it's a little bit awkward, like, oh, oh no. She needs to start singing quick, man, because this is getting a bit awkward. Sorry. Oh, come on. Well, I have, you, you have two choices here. Here we go. You kind of get rid of the key. Some people think. Man, do you know how mad that is here? So imagine going here to a performance or to watch David Foster in this scenario, right? And you know that if that artist picks out anyone from the crowd and they pick you here to sing, you don't even care, do you know what I mean? Like you're actually hoping for them to pick you so you can show everyone how you can sing. That is crazy. Because you know sometimes yeah, when you're like in a restaurant, yeah, and it's a bit of like an entertainment, um, entertainment like restaurant or whatever, just an entertainment place here where they may be dancing singing here and you know when they kind of like look to pick someone from the crowd and you're kind of doing all of this here so they don't pick you 
yeah, she's definitely not doing that if you can sing. Like, if I could sing like her, yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm not hiding at all. very intrigued to know yeah let me know in the comments below does anyone watching this year actually remember her when she was eight years old performing on Asia's Got Talent because if you do um, yeah that'll just be a funny turn of events but yeah if anyone remembers her let me know in the comments below This is a very popular song. It's a very famous song now. How did they not know what song this was? Now, that's insane. But yeah, maybe it's one of those. Yeah, they know the song, yeah, but like when someone tells you the name of that song, you're like, what's that? Do you know what I mean? But then when you hear it, you're like, oh, okay. <laughs> video and with this one we're not really going to discuss it too much because there's not much to discuss apart from sharing an incredible voice and fair enough um, so yeah this one was just a little bit of fun let me know in the comments below um, is this the kind of video or content you enjoy let me know in the comments below it doesn't even have to be music related you know what I mean so um, yeah let me know and uh, yeah I'll take it on board but yeah I'm gonna wrap things up now guys so thanks for watching make sure you like share subscribe comment below some more suggestions I'll try to check it out for you guys as always but I'm gonna have to love you and leave you. So thanks for watching. Keep yourself safe out there. Have a good day, have a good evening. And until next time guys, I hope you have a good one.